Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on our channel Immortal News. Today we'll be presenting a list of famous celebrities who have passed away, with announcements of their passing made in the last 24 hours. As always, we have special tributes in our today's top headline section. Before we proceed, we kindly ask for your support by giving this video a thumbs up. Let's begin, thank you. Number 7. Johnny Ruffo, A Resilient Star's Final Curtain Johnny Ruffo, the Australian singer, actor, and entertainer known for his remarkable journey in the entertainment industry, passed away on November 10th at the age of 35. His death follows a courageous battle with brain cancer, a challenge he faced with notable strength and optimism. Born in Balcata, Western Australia, Ruffo rose to fame as a finalist on the third season of The X Factor Australia in 2011. His dynamic performances and charismatic presence captured the hearts of many, leading to a recording contract with Sony Music Australia. His debut single, On Top, released in June 2012, achieved platinum status and peaked at number 14 on the ARIA singles chart. Rufo's versatility shone through when he won the 12th season of Dancing with the Stars Australia in 2012, showcasing his exceptional dance skills. He transitioned to acting with a memorable stint as Chris Harrington on the popular soap opera Home and Away from 2013 to 2016, expanding his artistic repertoire and earning a dedicated fan base. Rufo's career was marked by his resilience in the face of adversity. In 2017, he underwent surgery for a brain tumor, followed by an aggressive treatment plan. Despite his health challenges, Rufo continued to engage with his fans and share his journey, becoming a source of inspiration for many. He returned to music with singles like Broken Glass and Let's Get Lost, reflecting his personal struggles and triumphs. Rufo's impact extended beyond entertainment as he openly shared his battle with cancer, raising awareness and providing hope to others facing similar challenges. His determination and positive attitude in the face of adversity will be remembered as a significant part of his legacy. As the entertainment world mourns the loss of Johnny Ruffo, his spirit and contributions to music, dance, and acting remain an inspiration. His journey, marked by both talent and resilience, leaves a lasting impression on fans and colleagues alike. Tribute to Johnny Ruffo. Number 6. David Rene, A Brief Brilliant Spark in Fashion Sky David Rene, the newly appointed creative director of the iconic fashion house Moschino, passed away tragically on November 10th at the age of 46. His death, occurring just nine days after assuming his role at Moschino, has sent shockwaves through the fashion industry. Rene's appointment as Moschino's creative director was a momentous step in his career, announced on October 16th with much fanfare. His tenure, which began on November 1st, was cut short by a sudden illness, leaving the fashion world mourning the loss of a promising talent. Massimo Ferretti, chairman of Efe Spe, Moschino's parent company, expressed profound sorrow, stating, there are no words to describe the pain we are experiencing at this dramatic time. Before joining Moschino, Ren was the head of women's wear at Gucci, showcasing his exceptional talent and vision. He was selected to succeed Jeremy Scott, who led Moschino for a decade. Rene's first collection for Moschino was eagerly anticipated and was scheduled to debut at Milan Fashion Week in February 2024. His approach to fashion was marked by a philosophy that emphasized playfulness and joy, especially in the context of Italian fashion and Moschino's unique style. Ferretti, in his tribute, highlighted Rene's magnetic and creative spirit and the profound impact he had in his short time with the company. Ferretti remarked, even though he was only with us for a very short time, David was able to immediately make himself loved and respected. Ren's untimely departure is a significant loss to the fashion world, leaving behind a legacy of creativity and the unfulfilled promise of a visionary fashion leader. His death leaves a void in the industry, particularly at Moschino, where his imagination and creativity had begun to take shape. The fashion community extends its deepest sympathies to his family, friends, and colleagues. Tribute to David Arena. Number 5. 
Number 5. Nahi, a shining star in South Korean music. The music world mourns the sudden and mysterious loss of South Korean singer-songwriter Nahi, who passed away at the tender age of 24. Her record label, Manhua, confirmed her passing in a heartfelt Instagram post. Nahi, a rising talent in the South Korean music scene, had been captivating audiences with her emotional lyrics and catchy melodies since her debut in 2019. Her journey in music began with the release of her debut single, Blue City, followed by other beloved tracks like Blue Night and Gloomy Day. These songs, characterized by their heartfelt lyrics and memorable tunes, quickly won her a growing fan base. In 2020, Nahi's career took a significant leap when she signed with Moon Hua as both a singer-songwriter and producer, showcasing her multifaceted talent in the music industry. Her last performance, just days before her untimely death, was on October 29th, where she was seen joyfully singing and playing the guitar in front of her adoring fans. The news of Nahi's death has left her fans and the music community in shock and sorrow. Tributes have poured in, celebrating her life and legacy, with fans remembering her as a beautiful soul whose music touched many hearts. One fan poignantly wrote, We lost a young sweet person, but the sky has gained a star that shines without limits. As her fans promised to keep her memory alive by listening to her songs, Nahi's legacy as a talented artist will undoubtedly continue to inspire and move people. The music world has lost a bright star, but her music and spirit will continue to shine brightly. Tribute to Nahi. Number 4. Jeremiah Dennehy, A Football Icon's Enduring Legacy Jeremiah Dennehy, commonly referred to as Mia Dennehy, the esteemed Republic of Ireland international footballer, departed on November 10th, leaving behind a profound void in the sports world. His untimely passing at 73 due to health complications has deeply saddened fans and the football community. Dennehy's legacy in the world of football is marked by an illustrious career representing Ireland at the highest level. His exceptional skills, tenacity, and unwavering commitment on the field earned him not just acclaim but also the respect of fellow players and enthusiasts alike. Throughout his career, Dennehy's achievements were plentiful, marked by pivotal performances that left an indelible mark on the sport. His dedication to the game and his passion for representing his country were not just evident in his playing style, but also in his leadership both on and off the pitch. Beyond the accolades and victories, Dennehy's legacy lies in his humility, sportsmanship, and the inspiration he provided to aspiring athletes. His impact will resonate in the hearts of fans and the annals of Irish football, forever remembered as a true icon of the game. Tribute to Jeremiah Dennehy. Number 3. John Nuttall A Storied Career in Long-Distance Running John Nuttall, the accomplished British long-distance runner, passed away suddenly from a heart attack in Doha, Qatar, on November 9th, at the age of 56. Nuttall's career was marked by significant achievements on both national and international stages, making him a revered figure in the world of athletics. Natal demonstrated his exceptional talent early on. He claimed victory in the 3,000 meters at the English School's Athletics Championships and secured a third-place finish at the 1985 European Athletics Junior Championships. These early successes paved the way for his prolific career, which saw him represent Great Britain at the World Championships in Athletics in 1993 and 1995 and at the IELOF World Cross Country Championships on five occasions. Nuttall's collegiate career at Iowa State University was equally impressive, overcoming initial injuries to win the 1989 NCAA Division I Cross Country Championships and contribute to the Cyclones team victory. His time at Iowa State was further embellished with eight Big Eight Conference titles, and he was later inducted into the school's Hall of Fame in 2001.
The pinnacle of Nuttall's career came in 1994, a year that witnessed him secure a silver medal at the IAAF World Cup and a bronze at the Commonwealth Games in the 5,000 meters. He also made a notable appearance at the 1996 Summer Olympics, further solidifying his status as a prominent figure in long-distance running. He was initially married to fellow distance runner Allison Wyeth, and after their divorce, he married Liz McColgan, making him the stepfather to athlete Eilish McColgan. He had two children, Hannah and Luke Nuttall, both of whom followed in their father's footsteps as runners. John Nuttall's legacy extends beyond his medals and championships. He was a figure of inspiration and dedication in the world of athletics. His sudden passing is a significant loss to the sporting community, leaving behind a legacy of endurance, perseverance, and remarkable achievements. Tribute to John Nuttall. Number 2. Lynn McLean, a maestro of youthful melodies and dreams. Lynn McLean, a visionary who transformed the landscape of youth orchestral music, passed away on October 25th at his home in Washington, D.C., at the age of 95. Born in Binghamton, New York, on April 17, 1928, McLean's musical journey began early, influenced by his parents' passion for music. After receiving a robust education in music, Including degrees from Ithaca College, McLean's career took a decisive turn when he decided to exchange the transient life of a union musician for a more impactful role in music education. In 1960, McLean established the DCYOP at Calvin Coolidge High School with just 60 members. This program grew exponentially over six decades, shaping the lives of young musicians in the Washington, D.C., Maryland, and Virginia areas. McLean's inclusive approach welcomed all applicants fostering a culture of excellence and discipline. Under his guidance, students not only honed their musical skills, but also learned the value of dedication and hard work. McLean's relentless fundraising efforts allowed the DCY Op to perform at prestigious venues and embark on global tours, further enriching the students' experiences. His commitment to accessibility and diversity in classical music played a critical role in integrating minority musicians into the predominantly white world of symphony orchestras in the United States. Beyond his achievements with the DCY Op, McLean was recognized for his contributions to music education and cultural enrichment. His work resonated beyond the musical community, touching the lives of politicians, artists, and professionals in various fields. Lynn McLean's passing marks the end of an era in music education his unwavering dedication to nurturing young talent and broadening the horizons of classical music will continue to echo through the generations he inspired. He leaves behind a legacy of passion, perseverance, and transformative impact on the world of classical music. Tribute to Lynn McLean. Today's top headlines, News 1. The public radio community is mourning the loss of Eileen Heikinen Weiss, a beloved producer for Milwaukee's Udowem Lake Effect, who passed away at 39. Eileen died on October 31st due to injuries sustained in a car accident in Verona, Wisconsin, leaving a profound impact on those who knew her. Eileen's journey in public radio began at WBEZ in Chicago, where she honed her craft on several shows eventually leading the international affairs show, Worldview. After nearly a decade away from radio, exploring the world with backroads and sharing her passion for Peru, Eileen returned to her roots in journalism and audio storytelling. Joining WWWM in October 2023, Eileen quickly made her mark. Known for her intense curiosity, vibrant spirit, and deep care for community storytelling, she embodied the best qualities of public radio. Eileen's enthusiasm and innovative ideas revitalized Lake Effect and inspired her colleagues. Her family encourages donations in her memory to a local public radio station or animal shelter, reflecting her passions. Eileen's legacy as a dedicated storyteller and community builder will live on through the many lives she touched in her career and travels.
the public radio world has lost a remarkable talent and a cherished member of its family. News 2. In a tragic turn of events, a British couple met a fatal end while vacationing in Egypt, succumbing to carbon monoxide poisoning triggered by pesticide fumigation in a neighboring hotel room. John and Susan Cooper, hailing from Lancashire, fell gravely ill during their stay at Hurghada on August 21, 2018, a devastating conclusion drawn by the inquest. During their brilliant holiday at the Steigenberger Aqua Magic Hotel, a neighboring room sealed after a bedbug infestation was fumigated using pesticide Lambda. The toxic chemical, sometimes blended with dichloromethane in certain regions, led to a deadly outcome as the couple, innocently returning to their room, encountered the lethal fumes. Mr. Cooper, a builder, and Mrs. Cooper, a cashier, tragically passed away due to carbon monoxide poisoning caused by inhaling the pesticide vapors, marking a heart-wrenching incident illustrating the dire consequences of inadvertent exposure to lethal substances. Number 1. Spiros Focus, a stalwart of international cinema. Greek actor Spiros Focus, known for his remarkable career spanning several international productions, passed away on November 10th at the age of 86. Focus, born Spiros Androutsopoulos on August 17, 1937, in Patras, left an indelible mark on the world of cinema with his dynamic acting and charismatic screen presence. Focus's journey in the film industry began with his debut in Andreas Lambrino's film Bloody Twilight in 1959, which was showcased at the Cannes Film Festival the same year. This breakthrough led him to the bustling film studios of Sinitsita in Italy, where he embraced the opportunities that came his way. He starred in significant international productions such as Vincente Minnelli's A Matter of Time and Lucino Visconti's Rocco and His Brothers, sharing the screen with renowned actress Katina Paxinu. With over 30 films in his repertoire, Focus's career spanned Italy and the United States, where he was celebrated for his versatile acting skills. Apart from his film achievements, Focus also made a significant impact on television and theater starring in numerous drama series and plays, thereby enriching his artistic legacy. In his personal life, Focus was married four times, the last being to Lillian, with whom he had been since 2013. He had no biological children, but was a loving stepfather to Lillian's daughter. He spent his final days in a rehabilitation center in Eleusis, Greece, following a period of health issues. Spiros Focus's contribution to the world of cinema will be remembered for its breadth and depth, spanning diverse roles and cultures. His legacy continues to inspire actors and filmmakers globally. The film industry mourns the loss of this talented and revered actor who brought stories to life with his extraordinary talent. Tribute to Spiros Focus.